The Wolverines open the 2022 campaign this weekend in Tampa at the South Florida Tournament. If preseason vibes matter, this club, Team 45, is on the right track. They're pretty task oriented. They come in to get, get after it every day. And you know, being in the field house can get old pretty quick. So I, I appreciate that they come in every day, whether they're having their best day or not, and they get after it and they're, they're working hard. It starts here in practice, but I'd say overall the vibe has just been great. I think our team chemistry is growing. We've been getting along great and I'm really looking forward to what we bring this season. Any talk about the Wolverines has to start in the circle, where the team returns Alex Storacco and Megan Bobian. Both hurlers have been Big Ten Pitchers of the Year and All-Americans during their decorated careers. The pitching duo is back um, and ready for more. Um, and that's what's so exciting is we have so much experience, Megan and I, and we bring a lot to the table, but I think um, our freshmen bring even more, which is even more exciting. And now our pitching staff's deeper than ever as we've added, you know, three other pitchers. But without a doubt, Starocco and Bobian are, um, you know, they're our aces. And I certainly expect them to have to carry some more than their share of the load at times. This is as blended and balanced a team as we've seen in recent years. Four fifth years, two of them grad transfers, three seniors, four juniors, four sophomores, and five freshmen dot the roster. Got a great combination of some really seasoned veterans and some really great young talent. It's really a nice blend, and uh, I like how they connect with each other and how they walk in this field house every day to play for Michigan. general thing for us is just bringing them into the culture, understanding that the game is fast, but, you know, as a team, we work through that together, and I think they've done a great job. I think the freshmen especially, you know, they come out, they surprise us every single day. They have a wonderful skill set, and I think they're going to be great assets. The schedule is a bit different. No trip to Cali. Instead, back-to-back -back Florida visits to start the year, followed by the Duke Invitational, where they'll twice meet the Blue Devils, led by former Wolverine Marissa Young, and then the Kentucky Tournament before staying north. We've got a great schedule, one of the best we've had, and uh, we're up for the challenge. The home opener is March 12th against Kent State. We can't wait to get home play in front of our fans. We cannot wait. We have people calling about tickets, people calling me, I want to get season tickets, people that are going on the road to both Tampa and Clearwater, and our fans, uh, they can't wait to see us, but we cannot wait to see them. For MGO Blue TV, I'm Ed Kingerski.